Hey guys, we're on the streets. I'm with Leela, one of the awesome uh, members of the church, her and her husband. And you guys come all the way from where? We come from PA. We drive uh, from the Lehigh Valley two and a half hours. Wow, so two and a half hour drive. And literally they come and they're part of the church. And not only do they come, but they come out soul winning. Not only do they come out soul winning, but she's pregnant. She's out here soul winning, pregnant. We got another girl that's out here. Grace, she's out here. Literally week, days away from giving out the baby. And she's out here running people down and they, people are accepting Jesus. So I want you to say, just tell them the yeah. brief story of, since you've been out, you've been, you, went, you came out to Towson, you came out to the mall area, you, you've been coming out a lot. That's right. what, what are some of the cool stories that you would say that kind of, you know, reminds you and some impacts that you I'll made? I'll tell you the coolest story I was just talking about with Travis is um, this guy that we asked, has anyone ever told you God loves you, has a plan for your life? And he just had a blank and he's like, no, nobody's ever told me that. Wow. And then he just felt like the whole conversation was God ordained the fact that we got to yeah, like yeah. pray with him and he was like it's just so crazy I should run into you guys wow. and then told us more about his life and it was just a blessing like it was it was really a God ordained moment and yeah. I love those moments it's awesome you know yeah and her husband's coming out and uh, she was saying her husband is such a quiet guy but I took him out in the streets and guess what happened boom he began to explode and just like Lee his wife uh, she, he said, man, she's kind of quiet, but she's like, she's talking away out here. Why? Because the fire of God, when it gets on the inside of you, man, it's just, this is fun. Isn't it awesome? It is. This is, this is like a high. It really is. It's like it, going, you know, four wheeling or going to a, a, a music park is winning souls. And, and we know that only thing that's going to count in eternity is people. So that's guys, right. if you're watching today, please go out, win souls and, and don't worry about what people think. Don't, don't be consumed by rejection. They're not rejecting you, they're rejecting Christ, but you will run into people that are so precious. Me and Lee ran into a guy named Jeremiah, a young guy, 21, that lives in West Baltimore, one of the worst parts of Baltimore. And uh, man, we prayed for him. He was so thankful, so grateful. He's getting his life together. He's a manager at Walmart now. And you can see how God begins to work on people's hearts. And the harvest is truly plentiful. There's more people that won't accept than reject. So stay tuned. Thank you.